Hello everyone, when I'm in the general population and I'm around people that don't know me and I strike up a conversation with me, usually in the conversation, just like when you're talking to someone that doesn't know you, they say, oh, what do you do for a living? And, and I tell them, well, I'm, I'm a pastor, I'm, I'm a minister. And depending on their background, they'll say, oh, you're, you're a father, you're a priest. And uh, because in, in many religions, that's what a, a pastor or minister is called. But it brought to my mind what Old Testament priests, they had two uh, responsibilities, privileges, if you want to call them that. The first one was that priests were able to go into the temple, the dwelling place where the Shekinah glory of God dwelt. Uh, a, a regular Jewish person was able to go into the outer courts, but they were not allowed in the temple. That was a, a privilege that was reserved for priests, that they alone could go directly into the presence of God and worship and pray and speak to God right in the temple. And that wasn't afforded to the general population. The second privilege that they had was they were uh, privileged and given the responsibility to represent God to the people. They would speak to the people for God and say, God wants this and his word says that. Those were the two privileges of Old Testament priests. Of course, the Bible tells us when Jesus, the actual day and hour and moment that Jesus died on the cross, that the veil in the temple that separated the presence of God from ordinary people, that that veil was torn in two from the top down, that Jesus made a way for all of us to approach God directly. And if we do approach him and trust him and give him our life in salvation, then he turns us into modern day priests or ministers. And so it is our job now, just like the Old Testament priests, to represent God to the people around us, the world that doesn't know him. Second Timothy 1.9 says it this way, that we were saved and called to a holy purpose and that by God's grace, we are to show the world who Jesus is by how we live. That is our ministry, that we've all been commissioned as modern day priests and ministers to represent Jesus Christ in this world. So let's represent him well today.